Hey everyone, J.K. Whitey here with the Baseball Bank to give you a quick drill to help with vision. Now vision doesn't mean necessarily just your eyes. Obviously your eyes are important, but it also requires a head move back towards the plate. And a lot of players who turn really fast especially are going to have trouble turning their head back. Number one, because they're young and aren't developed as much as they will. And number two, they just don't practice it. So this is a great drill to help a player rotate their head back towards their shoulder as the shoulder rotates around to hit the ball. Now in our case, we're going to catch the ball. We're not trying to hit it. Uh, this is not a very aggressive move. It's just a simple drill um, after a player's footwork is in place where you can actually talk about moving the back foot still, but if you want to, you can keep the back foot right where it needs to be. As, as we rotate the body, turning the shoulder towards the ball, catching it, not reaching for it, and making sure the head and the shoulder, and the chin and the shoulder especially, come over the top of each other. Okay, so I'm going to stand in the batter's box. I'm a right-hander. I'm going to have a partner or a coach in front of me who's going to toss the ball just right down the middle. Nothing special here. You can work on different heights as you get more advanced. But for right now, we're just going to stay somewhat down the middle. Okay? And again, I can go ahead and get my feet set up so that I don't have to worry about too much footwork here and minimize it so that I can worry just about my head. Now, as the ball comes in, I'm going to rotate my chin back so that when I see the ball in my hand, I see the back of it. I'm not looking this way with my nose and face as I try to turn my eyes back to, to where I'm catching it. And then where, just like in, when I'm hitting, I don't want to turn my eyes back to contact, I want to turn my nose back to contact, which requires my head to move counter to my shoulders. Okay, so it's going to look something like this. I'm going to get set up. And as the ball comes in, I'm going to turn back. I'm going to do it very aggressively. So I'm going to make sure, even though the ball is right here, I'm going to over-rotate my chin just a little bit back over my shoulder to make sure I see it. Right there, I'm going to let it get a little bit deeper. Again, I don't want to reach here. It's really easy to sit here and just reach for the ball and not have any shoulder-back shoulder rotation. So I want to make sure that I'm rotating my shoulder as I'm catching the ball, really emphasizing seeing behind it. Something like that. Okay, very simple, very effective. You can use tennis balls, you can use baseballs, you can use weighted balls. The ball doesn't really matter. What matters is that the player, the young player, makes sure that the head is rotating back as the back shoulder rotates forward.